Welcome to MicroStrategy. My name is Michael Hoffmann and I'm working as a senior sales engineer for MicroStrategy Germany. With the following video I want to give you a short introduction of the powerful and easy to use Visual Insight mobile apps capabilities. It's a very flexible and robust technology that's based on MicroStrategy's Enterprise BI platform and it fits perfectly in the gap of self-service BI in conjunction with an on-demand insights distribution approach to mobile users. Visual Insight mobile apps are complement to MicroStrategy's traditional mobile apps and enrich the mobile platform capabilities. I will show you more than 95% of this demo live and even the process of how to build these apps within minutes. So I hope you will enjoy this little journey at my side. Now let's have a look at the main advantages of Visual Insight. First of all, it's possible to create BI apps within minutes or hours, not days or weeks, and this can be done by business people, not IT or BI experts. The second advantage is that the user can ask questions he hasn't thought about the day before. It's possible to dive in a kind of query flow where you can change your point of view on demand using all your business entities at your fingertips thanks to MicroStrategy's uniform abstraction layer or what we say self-service shop for business entities. And furthermore, the approach is extremely fast because all your calculations are done by MicroStrategy's powerful in-memory engine. Now let's start with the first live presentation. This is a mobile entry portal with links to three different VI mobile solutions. The first dashboard has a wide range of functionalities because it consists of seven different dashboard pages distributed over several layouts and panels. What you can see now is the first dashboard panel in the first layout. Visual Insight offers an interactive and flexible analysis approach. Grids and graphs work as a selector that control the behavior of other grids and graphs. Later on, you will learn that VE offers an additional filter panel where you can place business objects and KPIs for your individual filter scenarios. It's even possible to start a Drill Anywhere analysis based on MicroStrategy's uniform abstraction layer, where all the business entities and KPIs are described in a proper and redundance-free way. Now let's swipe to the next dashboard page. In this easy dashboard page I have combined a heat map with other graphs. The graphs are connected to each other in order to achieve an associative analysis experience. MicroStrategy Visual Insight offers special graph types to fulfill even more demanding scenarios. Now let's look at the third dashboard page. In this page I created a top-bottom analysis with the possibility to view profit changes over time. Both bar charts are working against the same line chart that distributes profit over time for the selected product. Until now, we saw three different dashboard pages that correspond to the same layout in our Visual Insight solution. But we have even more layouts in place. At the bottom of the dashboard, you can select the dashboard layout you need. Now we started the second layout with the name Category Analysis. On the left side of the dashboard, you can see the flexible filter panel. The panel works against all the dashboards in the same layout, even if these dashboards are distributed over several panels in the same layout. With this approach, you can implement very powerful and focused dashboard pages within the same dashboard solution. You can use all your business entities and metrics as a selector, and you can even derive new metrics on the fly based on more than 300 mathematical functions that are available due to MicroStrategy's in-memory engine. You will see this process later on when I'm showing you how to implement a VI solution in less than 10 minutes. Now let's have a look at the next dashboard page. The page is called Time Analysis and uses derived metrics and graphical thresholds in order to achieve a top N percent ranking. InfoZoom windows are very helpful to focus on critical issues. Based on your fingertips, Visual Insight recalculates your analysis context in milliseconds and updates your business view. You can even use and upload your local Excel or CSV files with more than one million rows in order to analyze them immediately and share your results by web or mobile.
all the pages you've seen so far are part of the same Visual Insight dashboard. It's up to you how many pages you would like to implement and how these pages correlate with different filter scenarios. This supports even a trial and error approach because it's so easy to check things out or to change your analysis strategy. In this example both graphs correlate to each other. Even this behavior is possible and can be combined with the filter panel of the layout. In this example we use a slider control to filter on customer age. This is the last dashboard page of our dashboard and it's called Top Customers. It uses a very powerful graph matrix control to control the behavior of the other sections. As usual, everything is interconnected in order to implement a very flexible analysis experience. Now I want to show you a more advanced solution that uses geographical capabilities in order to create transparency on demand. In this example I combined an interactive geographical view with other controls so that the user is able to analyze the data from a geographical point of view. This analysis is very flexible because you can zoom and highlight objects in the map. For your selection you can use a set of different selected types that are all available in the geographical control by default. Let's have a look at how this works. This is not a trick, it's my finger on the iPad. The next example is a special one. It uses a prompt for filtering when the dashboard starts. This means that the data is reduced based on the filter selections in the prompt. With this approach it's even possible to combine traditional MicroStrategy mobile apps with Visual Insight mobile apps in that way that we transmit the user context from one dashboard to the Visual Insight dashboard automatically. I choose special controls for this dashboard the network control in conjunction with the graph matrix. Both are related to each other. The network control shows coherences between two business objects. 
based on three different metrics and you can change the visualization on demand. If we select a product category in the network control, it changes the graph matrix. If we select a region in the graph matrix, it changes the network control. It's also possible to annotate and share your results. This functionality is available directly within Visual Insight. My last mobile example shows the combination of a traditional MicroStrategy mobile app with a VE app in that way that we want to pass the context from the traditional mobile app to the VE app. I want to demonstrate this behavior with the grid at the bottom of this MicroStrategy mobile app. If I select a region in the first app, the VE app starts with this context thanks to the dynamic prompt mechanism. You saw the mobile world of Visual Insight so far. Now I want to show you the same solution in a web browser. It looks the same, but offers me even more functionality. Because the web frontend is the tool for end users and dashboard designers as well, who work as business users, not IT or BI experts. These are the different layouts of the solution. And these are the different panels of the first layout. The first layout is called Overview. This slider belongs to a derived metric that's not available in the data source. This metric was derived in memory based on MicroStrategy's analytical engine. Most of the graphs offer graphical selection capabilities. The geographical capabilities are the same in the web frontend. And passing the user context from a traditional MicroStrategy dashboard in web to a Visual Insight dashboard is the same in web too.